You guys know David O. Now that one celebrity in Nigeria that can never take a break. Something, 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 something must happen. Please allow the guy to enjoy his marriage. Allow him enjoy his marriage. But meanwhile, guys, uh, check out this video. It shows David O. hungrily. Not slap per se, but like a, like a fingertip. A fingertip just touching the guy's face. Like this. Like this. So now, to all David O's fans, because the David O is currently being dragged, dragged well, to all David O's fans, do you honestly believe that David O intended slapping that guy? Or David O slapped the guy? Because according to headline, to the way, uh, this guy Benny said, David O really slapped a full grown man at his wedding ceremony, abusing people in broad daylight. Is now cool? That was the question he asked. So, to David O fans, do you honestly think David O intended to slap that guy? Because the only reason David O raised his hand and just gave that guy a little tip eh, was because that guy was trying to oppress that small boy. He was trying to drag that boy away. He said, no, leave that boy alone. So, David Doe, for what I can see here, David Doe was trying to defend that small boy. David Doe was trying to defend that small boy. So, I don't know what actually happened. I don't know how it happened. I don't know what that guy was whispering to that boy. I don't know why. I don't know what happened. I don't know what he was intending doing. But, that was actually a slap. But not a strong slap. It was like, leave her now. Leave her now. We, you know, sometimes at the day, my guy, I bet come on, dear now. Leave her now. Now, wait till they worry. Now, let her stay now. It's not as if I intended slap. No, not the middle of slap. Slap now, like this. I carry my hand. Whoa, person slap. Like, leave her now. Uh -uh. What is it? Leave him. You understand? Well, anyhow, we want to talk. Huh? Some people will see drag the David Doe tossing a slap. But the question is, do you honestly think that was a slap? Or it was just, just a honest warning. A honest warning like, leave her now. Leave, leave the small boy alone. Leave the small boy alone now. Because David Doe is currently being dragged. David Doe just had to even quickly respond. To read because of people we are kind of like painting another different picture of what happened that day. David Doe wasn't really happy about it, and David Doe quickly wrote. He said, "Note: F what people got to say. I stay active. F what people got to say. I stay active." Go and hug that Davido's bouncer. That is, that is somebody who is really, really close to Davido, who can give his life on Davido's behalf because of what Davido has done. I know it doesn't really make it an excuse for anybody to hit anybody because of what you have done for them. But we know very well that guy, particular guy, could do anything for Davido. Anything for Davido because that guy is Davido's personal bouncer. It's not as if that guy was employed only for that occasion. No. That one, person, now David Doe, main person, personal bouncer. Personal bouncer. That is David Doe, personal bouncer. So they have a long history. If David Doe was an abusive boss, that guy for the run. That guy for the run. David Doe trusted that guy to the point that that guy was stationed to be with Choma all through. That was the only bodyguard that was staying with Choma. And not just only that, that guy was still even at times involved picking money. The same money made David O to say he no correct. Like many, many money they miss. That guy too still pick. So I don't think it was a slap, honestly. I think it was just an honest warning. Leave the guy boy, leave the child now. Let him stay there now. Why did they disturb the boy? Something like that. Leave the boy. Why, why you the disturber now? Something like that. Well, check out the story. This lady is not happy with the way her boyfriend is treating her. 
So just listen to what this girl told her boyfriend. What are you talking about? I say if you see the way they do today, they all show money, they kiss Shoma. And this month, he not even wants to make anybody come close to Shoma. He loved the wife then. If you see how they all are many years, and not be say the video not pop person, the video get money that you won't be saying no, you get any money, no get shin shi. Go they do, it go be a safe person, they force himself from you. No sense, well. Wait, so, so I, I don't get money, and I need to touch you. You get money before. See, see the marriage. David o, David o was one of the happiest person on earth today. Since they born me, I never seen marriage when be seen at the groom happy pants the bride. David o was so happy. He just they treat Shoma like egg. Any small thing go they touch her, he go kiss her, he go they play with Shoma, go rest here on top of Shoma's shoulder. You ain't no get money. You feel do rich like that. Never mm. get money. You don't get pride. See, David o ain't get money. Die pride in no day for your wife they say. Oh, okay, wait, because because I don't touch you now. Oh, because I'm I'm not touch you. I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg, I beg. No sense, really. well, I bet they touch your girlfriend there. Eh? Allow your girlfriend kiss you, kiss your girlfriend, hug your girlfriend. Let us feel, feel special. But then again, you now feel take the heat, make your take to all those girls. Because we argued this thing the other day. The women like the good part, but they don't like the other part. Can you withstand the heat that your ma? God from David O. Hmm? Can you withstand the heat? As should they praise David O say they touch your Choma? Why don't you also say and talk about how David O they deal with Choma for the other way? Eh? Can you honestly take the heat? Can you take the heat? That's the question. Can you take the heat? Eh? Can you take the heat? Eh? Can you? Now you want to make your boyfriend they act like Choma. I act like uh, David O. Say the form. You know, get any shishi, but you go the form. Okay, now. Okay, now. So, the I think that girl need full package. So, her boyfriend give her full package. But no, say, woman go say, copy the good side of David O. No, copy the other side of David O. You understand? Now, like I say, they always be. Ah. <laughs> uh, but uh, that being uh, that being that, let's talk about a very dark man. Very dark man. A pastor have issued him a warning. He said, "Very dark man, be careful that he had a dream. God, you not had a dream. God spoke to him. God revealed to him that some few persons are trying to assassinate." very dark man he said god spoke to him that some few persons are trying to assassinate very dark man <laughs> of course eh, mm, you are now already know eh, with everything that is going around with very dark man even a child will tell very dark man to be careful so a pastor now single-handedly specifically coming out and saying God told him, I know understand. Because ordinarily, eh? Ordinarily, very dark man should be careful. And I do not think the very dark man has a step on toes that can end his life. Honestly. But sometimes, sometimes you don't know the kind of offense you might offend someone. And that person might just carry harm and start uh, looking for you to buy. But I don't think very dark man has done anybody that kind of strong thing before. That will lead to that person looking for his life. But notwithstanding, if I am very dark man, I will be careful with my life. Because of the kind of activism I do. I will be careful with my life. I do not need a pastor. Or anybody to tell me to be careful. I will be careful on my own. Because it's normal. Even a child will tell, will tell me. we tell very dark man. Be careful. Even a child. Looking at what he has been going through. What he has gone through. The kind of things he represents. We tell him. Be careful. You do not need a pastor. It's like me putting my hand inside the fire. And I know that fire will burn me. And it's already burning me. Another person is telling me. That fire will burn me. There is no need for you to tell me that fire is burning because I already know it is burnt. 
Well, pray for a very dark man. That's according to the uh, to the uh, pastor. He needs our prayer. He needs our uh, help. So just do the little bit you can do for very dark man. Pray for him. Bye, guys. <laughs>